Once again, Camilla Larson will parade the field of the post for race seven, the review stake for three-year-old trotting fillies, $40,000 on the line. Win, play, show, exact, a trifecta wagering. Let's meet the starters. Number one, NY Starlet is owned by Jackpot Stable and Alimento Kronor Stable of Sweden, trained by Jimmy Tactor, and Jimmy Tactor will drive. Number two is Appeal to Reason. Appeal to Reason is owned by Brittany Farms, by Jerry and Rosalie Silva, and by David Scharf of New York, New York, and Versailles, Kentucky, trained by Ron Gerfine, the driver Mike Lachance. Number three is No Pan, No Gain, owned by the Peter Pan Stables, Incorporated of Pepper Pike, Ohio, trained by Ivan Sugg. Dave Pallone drives No Pan, No Gain. Number four is Salagadula, owned by Joyce and Richard McClelland of Zanesville, Ohio. The trainer driver, Dave Rankin. Number five, Daffy Yankee, owned by Bob and Gail Sanders of Manuka, Illinois, trained by Bob Sanders with Randy Jacobs driving. Number six, Judge Judy, owned by Doug Ackerman Stables, Incorporated of LaPorte, Indiana, trained by Doug Ackerman, his son, D.R. Ackerman, the driver. Number seven is Victory Slide, owned by Joseph Pinaccio of Highland Beach, Florida, trained by Per Erickson, Eric Ledford, the driver. And number eight, Yankee Topaz, owned by Bill Wright, by Mystical Marker Farms, and by Donald Coleman of Morton, Chicago Heights, and Lebanon, Illinois. Trained by Dirk Simpson of Sherman, the driver is Dave McGee. Here they come. They're off and trotting. Judge Judy goes out for the lead. No pan, no gain is away in good order. Appeal to reason there toward the inside, along with NY Starlet, who moves up third, heading on to the first turn. No pan, no gain is on the outside. Appeal to reason keeps her parked for better than the first eighth of a mile. As NY Starlet goes third, now no pan, no gain has made the top clear by a length and a half. Appeal to Reason is second, then NY Starlet, Judge Judy, Salagadula, Yankee Topaz, Daffy Yankee next to last, and Victory Slide trails. 28 seconds for the opening quarter. No pan, no gain is the leader heading on to the back stretch. The lead is just one length. Appeal to Reason goes second down the backside. NY Starlet is third, their single file. Judge Judy is fourth. Salagadula hugs the rail in fifth. Yankee Topaz is on the outside in sixth. Daffy Yankee is behind her. Victory Slide is last. Yankee Topaz is gearing up on the outside for Dave McGee. Was near the back of the pack a moment ago. She's second, and now she's about to snag the lead. The half in 58 and four. Yankee Topaz takes over past the draw gate, leading it by a length and a half. No pan, no gain is second. Then comes Appeal to Reason. NY Starlet is next toward the inside. Then Judge Judy, who goes fifth toward the rail. She's locked in tight because Daffy Yankee is keeping her pinned down. Then Salagadula got the shuffle. Back toward Victory Slide, who's last. At the three-quarter, Yankee Topaz leading no pan, no gain, and appeal to Reason, who's third, takes to the outside. Three-quarters, 127 and four. NY Starlet is fourth and has to go three wide off the last turn. Yankee Topaz leads it now by three lengths. No pan, no gain is second. Eighth of a mile remaining. Into the stretch, appeal to Reason third. Yankee Topaz under a drive now, leads it by two. No pan, no gain is second. Appeal to Reason, Judge Judy, and then NY Starlet. Yankee Topaz has the lead. Judge Judy comes up the rail late, but no catching. Yankee Topaz, who wins it by two. Close for second, either Judge Judy or no pan, no gain for the second spot. The time, one minute, 56 seconds flat. Bill Wright of Morton, Illinois, the owner, along with Mystical Marker Farms of Chicago Heights and Donald Coleman of Lebanon, Illinois. The winning three-year-old filly is by Lindy Lane, bred by Yankee Land Farms Incorporated of Maryland, trained by Dirk Simpson, who now makes his residence in Sherman, and driven by Green Bay, Wisconsin native Dave McGee. 156, new lifetime record for this filly. Louise Powers is the caretaker, so Louise will pick up that caretaker's medallion for this Grand Circuit event. From a little kid on, and I'm, I don't mind saying I'm 63 years old, and there's still a fire in my belly to win. So get into this business and have fun.